A free, independent, and pluralistic media offers vital benefits to society. It ensures people have unrestrained access to reliable information, it encourages the exchange of views, and it prompts greater political participation. Media raise issues that may not otherwise get public attention, such as corruption, political wrongdoing, or human rights abuses. A free press reinforces the rule of law and contributes to good governance. Yet press freedom worldwide is increasingly under threat, and Africa is no exception. While some countries have made progress, others have stalled. Many journalists and media professionals on the continent are still targets of violence, intimidation, and harassment, particularly women. Ensuring the safety of journalists and combating impunity for those responsible are essential conditions to press freedom. In the early 21st century, media organizations and citizens in Africa are relying more and more on social media to disseminate and access information. But this social media boom also raises new challenges, such as the propagation of hate speech, fake news, and disinformation. Today, more than ever, navigating the new media landscape in Africa requires strong information literacy skills. Young people, in particular, need to learn how to think critically about information in the digital age. Training media professionals on ethics is another priority to tackle disinformation, hate speech, and violent extremism. What good practices and standards can help reshape Africa's media landscape? How can media help foster peace in Africa, and what are successful examples in this area? How can we counter hate speech, violent extremism, and discrimination in African media, particularly social media?